Hey everyone, welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. Last time out, we helped Wakako get back in contact with her net runner, Chiang Hu Nam, who we thought had come to uh, something of a sticky end, but turns out that he'd actually just got himself locked in some sort of limbo where he, he couldn't get past his own building subnet. Um, and uh, yeah, much to his concern, he thought he's going to uh, he's going to have to fess up that he screwed up to some other junior netrunner by the sounds of it called uh what was it spectral boy i think it was called um he's not looking forward to him rubbing his nose in it and then we came down here to uh where exactly are we are we still in japan town no we're not we're in charter hill aren't we yeah we came on down to charter hill to go and see if we could recover some uh some data for mr gutierrez who'd been kicked out of his apartment by his wife after she found that he was taking bribes and generally being rather corrupt up in uh, city hall now i was just about to jump back in my mind my here but i remember we've got a ripper dock over here which i wouldn't mind visiting is uh medical assistance <laughs> oh oh god i'm not gonna need medical assistance when i leave this place Ooh, ooh! This is very clean and swanky. Look at this. Um, hi there. Are you? No, you're not the Ripper Doc, are you? Okay, you're just reception, and you don't have an awful lot to say. Uh, who have we got in here? This is very nice. This is very corporate. This is very Arasaka. I'm actually beginning to uh, to become a little bit worried. Look at this. This is quite possibly the shiniest. Uh, the shiniest Ripper Docks place that I've ever seen. Almost as impressive as Lucy Thackeray's. Hi, um, yeah, never seen you around. You new here? Seem to remember this ugly, slimy gonk type with oozing flesh running the shop. <laughs> My uncle is not a handsome man, I know. <laughs> but oh. it is hard to forget once you see him. Preem, yeah. Nothing like serving up a howler first time you meet someone. Talk to him. You think it's a mistake to speak the truth? True or not, it was rude, hurtful. What else would you call it if not a mistake? Huh. Ah, and that is why I love to travel. Words. We think we know how to use them, but then there is context. Right, okay. Um, yeah, you just started out and you've taken over your uncle's place. You, you look pretty, uh, pretty sort of well put together here. So, just starting out in this biz? No. I move around in this biz. I run shops in Irkutsk, Leningrad, Vienna, and Glasgow. I thought it was time to try a night city. My uncle rented me the shop because it was my birthday. I'm 30. Hmm. I will sit here and run the business until I get bored. Okay. Um, yeah, what do you think of the city? So, our city of dreams. What do you make of it? How does it weigh up to Glasgow? It's wonderful. Compared to the USSR, it's so different. Like it that much, really? Yes, terribly. You shoot at each other in the street. You must pay for first aid, emergency help. It's a nightmare, but so <laughs> interesting. <laughs> yeah, I suppose you got the luxury of being able to study our way of life, seeing as the moment you get bored, you can just jet out of here and go set up shop somewhere else. And thinking about getting some new chrome. Then I think you'll come to the right place. Well, Ripper Doc Clinic is probably the best place for new crime. Um, right, now, tempting fate. <laughs> Let's see if my new purchase of, uh, of this five-slot cyber deck was in vain. Um, <laughs> well, I suppose in a way it was. It looks like we've got at least a six-slot. Yeah, we've got a six-slot here, but we don't have the intelligence score for it. Okay, so we need 20 intelligence for that. Hmm. Okay, uh, worth bearing in mind, though. Um, a little bit of a basic one of Berserk. More berserk. Okay, nothing else of uh, of interest there. Let's see. We've got nine items available for skeleton. Surely there's got to be something we like. Carry weight, carry weight. What's this? Dense marrow. Stamina uh, increases stamina cost of melee attacks. Yeah, in exchange for damage. Everything else is yeah, everything else is skill locked. That's a shame. We do have epic level, uh, signal optimizer. And micro rotors. So, worth bearing in mind. Hands, anything? No. Arms? No. We've already got top tier. Legs? No. Right, let's see. Nothing there. We've got one item for nervous system. What's available? 
Uh, no upgrades there by the looks of things. Okay. Oh, I spotted this last time. I didn't actually look at it. What is this? Nano relays. Increases Stan Devastan and Karensikov durations by one second. Well, that's useless to us. Nothing for immune system. Wait, Kat. Wait. Wait, did we have this before? I don't remember seeing that icon. Okay, anyway. Nothing there that we can take. Um, vessels. Tyrosine injector. Enhances intracellular transduction. Breach protocol. Okay, not really that interested. Nothing there. Frontal cortex. No. Okay. Um, thanks very much for your time. I'll uh, I'll catch you around. I might have to pop back uh, another time if I drastically increase intelligence. In fact, where are we on intelligence? Twelve. Yeah, we're some way off. I'm not going to be seeing you for a while. But bye now. Uh, oh, hello, Panem. V, do you have a moment? Uh, yeah. Talk? I mean, no longer moment. Can you come by the camp? I have a problem. Uh, okay. Yeah, why are you calling me? You're back in with the Cardos now, aren't you? Got a problem, and you're calling me? Thought you rejoined the family. Well, I... Yes, I did. But I thought... I suppose that means you're not willing to come, am I right? Nah, I never said that. Um... Oh, I don't really want to sort of head straight over there. Um, yeah, I'll tell her that I'll go, but, I mean, I've got a couple Hello? of things I want to do first. Are you there? On my way. Phew. Thanks. That's good to hear. Give me a little more intel. What's your grief? Well, it uh, would be better to... Let me guess. Saul, right? Hmm. You know me well. Mm-hmm. See you soon. Hmm, with a little help from my friends. Right, we are going to go and help Panam, but just not quite yet. There's a few things I want to do in and around town first. First of all, it's picking up the Quadra Turbo R740 that um, Wakako had, uh, had offered us. What's this place? Is this... Wait, is this off limits? <laughs> Am I going to be uh, looked upon with disdainful eyes? Where is this? Hmm, okay. Um, I think I'm in someone's corporate car park. Doesn't look like there's much of interest there. Uh, yeah, I want to pick up this Quadra. And then I'm going to go and pluck the... What looks to be... The last side gig for Wakako Wakada, at least at the moment. I don't know whether more might unlock once we complete that. What's that building over there? So many interesting things down in Charter Hill. Uh, um, right, over here, apparently. Oh, yeah, another Corpo car park by the looks of things. Right, let's um, hop it over. Oh, <laughs> I thought this was a car park. We're just taking the scenic route. Don't mind us. Damn. Oh, look at her. She's very pretty. She's very expensive. <laughs> She's very expensive. I mean, I know we get a huge discount because of the, uh, the mods that I'm running, but still, nearly 26,000 eddies. How many do we have at the moment? Oh, we've got a... Okay, that would still leave us in six figures if we, uh, if we bought this Quadra. So, hmm... I am... I would like to collect all of the vehicles, but I feel this is going to start seriously draining our bank account. But you know what? Screw it. She's she's a pretty, pretty beast. Let's go for it. We set a wheels. We got a turbo. This thing had better be turbo as well. Seeing as I just dropped this much cash on it. Right, let's, uh, let's walk around and explore. We can't open up anything at the front. Do we have stash access? Oh, please! <laughs> We don't have stash access. Really? There's got to be stash access somewhere. That's like three vehicles in a row that I think I've picked up with no access to stash. Right, well, uh, let's have a look at the interior. Oh, I love the sliding door. Ooh. Oh, this is pretty. This is very pretty. Let them... <clears throat> now, hold on a minute. Um... Maybe Mora Rock. There we go. That's a bit more mellow. Um, very cool. Lots and lots of red. I like it. Now, uh, oh god, got a robot right there. Better watch what we're doing. Hold on, what's that? Dinala. Let's take a look at the map because we're just around the corner. In fact, now I've just shelled out twenty six k. Um, I, <laughs> I think I might go on foot. Seems we're such a short distance away, but that's a that's a very pretty little beastie. 
I'm just, I'm really annoyed I don't have any stash access on, on like, practically all of my vehicles. Um, right, looks like we're in a bit of a dead end here. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, I do not want to mess with those guys. They look like they mean business today. So, let's head on over and, uh... No, I haven't heard anything. We lost contact with them Wait. a few days ago. We don't plan to... Uh-huh. Who are these guys? Veteran guards. I'll inform his family. I want to know what's going on there. That looks interesting. Um, let's head round the corner. I, I'm going to do this side gig for Wakako. And then we need to sort of work out a bit of a plan. I'm wondering if... Oh, okay. Vee, my dear. I need you to pay a visit to a tiger claw den and retrieve something for me. Okay. I know you are up to the task. I am attaching more information. Read it carefully. Hmm, okay. Uh, gig type thievery against the claws, okay. Steel vortex, vortex! <gasps> this is who, this is who Hang Chun was trying to actually uh, track down. Steel vortex's cred chip. The, the Tiger Claws Casino on Longshore South. The vulture is the wisest bird. While others lose strength in the pursuit of prey, the vulture waits patiently. It only spreads its wings when it smells blood on the air. You will be my vulture, V. I heard a Tiger Claws Casino has been robbed by one of their own, a dealer. The girl has an alias, Vortex. Ah! So I wonder if she went to ground after robbing the casino. And she managed the casino's machines. She programmed them to skim a small percentage, so a drop from each win landed in her bucket. It took years for the tigers to realize how they were being cheated. You can imagine they were not pleased. But their ferocity extended too far. Vortex died during the interrogation before revealing where she stored the stolen money. Oh, a vulture is wiser than a tiger, V. You will find it. I'll send you the Vortex's last known location. Don't let me down. Right. Um, let's see who these guys are. Security guards, no affiliation. Hmm, all right. I guess they're just doing security guardy things. Um, right, let's get inside the casino then. So, uh, wait, am I on the wrong side of the wall here? I think I am. Am I? No, I'm not. Oh, okay, there's, there's sort of an underpass. Excuse me, coming through. Wait. This can't be right. This is a... Hold on. This is a casino entrance? What in the world? Where's... Right, I'm very confused right now. Fine, I'll blindly follow your instructions, minimap. Don't lead me astray. So... I... I... I don't like any bit of this. No, none whatsoever. Right, I thought we were going to be um, glitz and glam and walking across red carpets and all sorts, but... um. <laughs> Apparently, this is an underground casino. Oh. This is a very, literally, underground casino. Right. Now, the question is, am I still in a public-ish area? That's the question. Technical abilities lacking there. Are you going to get in a bit of a mood if I walk past you? Got my eye on you, chap. Right. No, it looks like we're okay. Uh, hmm. Hi. Uh, hi there. Hold up. It's paid to get inside. Oh, really now? All right, what are we talking? 1700 to get into a card joint. First time I hear a casino have an entrance fees. Don't agree with it? Then fuck off. No one's forcing you. Hmm. Yeah, I suppose that's fair. Um, right, now, as far as I know, what we're after isn't actually inside this casino. It sounds as though we're just here to sort of uh, wrecky the joint and try and pick up information from Vortex, so... Of course it is. Hmm. Have fun. <laughs> Thanks. Right, uh, is it worth... No, it, it looks like we're on friendly terms at the moment. This is... Casino? Seriously? Okay. Hello there. Lovely evening we're having. Um, right. Plenty of tigers around to keep people in. Oh my god, it gets worse. <laughs> yeah, plenty of tigers around to keep people in line. All right. Um, oh, we can, we can have a little looky-loo inside the place, first of all. 
Oh, this is a storage room off to the side. Right. How's your day going? Win anything? <laughs> yeah, a few eddies here and there. <laughs> At least that's something, right? But I didn't spend them all second I got them. Yeah. Yeah, that is the way of the casino. Uh, right, we've got... Oh, we can. We can open that, actually. Nobody seems to be looking this way, so... Nothing really stopping us from, uh, just slipping on inside. Alright. Loot and pilfer from the house. Oh, two and a half thousand eddies. Brilliant. We've already, uh, taken back our entrance fee and made a profit. Uh, server room, you say? Interesting. Guessing that is off limits. Right, let's not push our luck just yet. We do have eyes on us. Restrooms. Hey, how's the cash flow? Don't even ask. It's Annie's. It's pathetic. Say what you will about Vortex. She could work the machines. Hmm. Not like our new gun. Okay. So, th that's something I meant to say as well. Interesting that, um... Interesting that uh, Chiang Hoon was chasing after Vortex to try and track her. <laughs> you you seem to need to work on your aim, sir. I don't know why I'm checking the toilets. What am I even looking in here for? Let's have a look in the other one just for completeness sake. Hello there. Right, we've got something to hack here. Um, yeah, so interesting that Chiang Hoon was trying to track her down and it turns out that she... Uh, she was off a little while back anyway. Right, let's try for lines two and three. So we start with BD. BD 1C is not going to work. Hmm. Okay, let's try 5-5. Five, five. That's not going to work either. Wonderful. Um, right. BD 1C 5-5-5-5. Five, 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 five. 1C BD, that will work. Right. BD, 1C, 5, 5, uh, 5, 5, 5, 1, C, BD. Lovely. Um, yeah. So, Vortex is no more. Now, I did say before, didn't I? I wonder if Vortex has anything to do with that Kangtao shipment that we were talking, uh, that we'd read about as well. Um, hi there. Uh, Interesting place. Lots of uh, tigers. I see a lot of tigers. They run this place. That's right, and very well. Know what else they do well? Break the knees of people who ask questions. Yeah, they've got a bit of a reputation of not particularly liking people who stick their nose in. Uh, tell me more about the place. I want to stick my nose in. How's the casino trade? Any big wins out there? Of course. Anyone can win big. You just have to want it. Why not play yourself then? Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's against my religion. What if? I'm a Muslim. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you also sell alcohol. <laughs> what, you a fucking expert on the Torah now? Mind your own business. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh. Uh. Am I gonna rouse suspicion by prying? Woman used to work here. A net runner. Name's Vortex, you know her? I see you're searching for trouble. <laughs> Whatever your reason, don't involve me. I know nothing. Oh, which means you quite obviously know something. Um, no, I'm not going to threaten the poor guy. You must know something. You're the barkeep, after all. Everyone's liquor lips start flapping. And you're the only pair of silver ears around. I'm not talking. Fuck off. Hmm. Really think that it put this all behind you. I still learn what I want to know. Something happens your troops don't like, then they remember who you talked to today. Whether you actually kept your mouth shut or not. Tell me what you know. I go about my biz quietly. No one finds out. No one comes knocking for you. This Vortex you care so much for, she cheated them, okay? So they threw her body in the sewer. Oh. Same spot the kitchen dumps used cooking oil. Bodies there don't last long. That's all I know. So fucking leave me alone. Oh, excellent. Nice. Um, 
Right, let's have a little bit of a poke around, but it sounds like we don't actually need to be around here for very long. So, they, wow, they killed her and then threw her body in the river, which is so, in the sewer, sorry, which is so toxic that it just disintegrates people by the sounds of things. Right, let's uh, slide on around here and take a look. So this is the storage area. Um, uh, presumably this area is supposed to be off limits, so let's see what happens when... Oh, hello. Um, I'm guessing this thing wouldn't actually take notice of me until I walk into a restricted area, which I'm guessing is when we just slippity slide here. Whoa. Oh, they didn't like that. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Now, I noticed that all of those... Uh, all of those spots came from directly behind me, so... I'm wondering if there's even anybody inside. We could just slip on in under the cover of... Ta-da! There we go, close the door behind us. Nice, we're in. Right. We've got a computer here that we could take a little look at. Oh, what's this? Uh, just a max dog. Okay, three messages. Fix ceiling from... I can't even make out that name because of the glare behind me. Mackie something to Iori Hada. Hey, are we getting someone to plug that hole in the ceiling? You know, in storage behind the bar. Oh, that's in here. Not urgent, I know, but it's ugly as sin and getting all kinds of critters crawling through. I'm tired of it. Thanks, Mackie. Hmm, interesting. Might be uh, good to see where that leads. Netrunner. Oh, from Iori. What was the name? Iori Hado. So I wonder if Iori's maybe the boss of this place? Don't fucking ignore this email. We got a runner helping us score back the Eddie's Vortex swipe from the casino. We gave him a room on the second floor. So give the guy some peace and fucking quiet, will you? Ooh. So they've got their own Netrunner here trying to recover the assets that Vortex stole. Hey, got a problem. Uh, ooh. Oh, never mind. It's just spam. All right, let's, uh... Oh, <laughs> I thought something weird had happened then. Take a little look and see if we can't score some eddies whilst we're here. Might as well pilfer these uh, filthy claws for everything they're worth. Nice! Uh, lines 1 and 2 eliminate each other, so... We do 5, 5, 7A, 7A... Wait, it's literally... Oh my god. 5, 5, 7A, 7A, 1C. Okay. 5, 5, 7A... 7A, 1C. Beautiful. Well, that was nice and straightforward. Okay. Uh, now, before I go any further, let's have a look at their camera network. Right, so here we are. Nobody around the corner by the looks of it. Oh, where's the where's the hole in the ceiling? Hmm. I don't actually see it. I'm sure they were talking about here. Uh, right, this one is... Oh, wow, look at this. Yeah, there's a whole balcony floor up here. Wow, so there's more storage. I wonder if this is where that... Oh, there's the office. That's where we're supposed to be getting to, the casino office. So we need to head upstairs at some point. Uh, that's the one out by reception. Uh, here's the one on the main gaming floor. There were some doors on the other side as well that we haven't looked through yet. Oh, the corner of the gaming floor. Looks like this guy's heading to back towards the bar. And then back in here. Okay. Right, cool. Let's uh, see what we have. Right. Mm. Some of the hitboxes on some of these items are really, really quite janky. Oh, okay. Some weapons. I don't mind taking those away and disposing of them for you. Thank you very much for the claws. There, there we go. There's the hole in question. I'm not going to pop my head up uh, to a tiger-infested room here, am I? No. Looks like we're all right. So this is going to be on that second floor that we saw. So we need to be careful because there were at least one or two tigers on the balcony outside. Oh, I wonder if we're coming out by that storage room that I saw. Oh, we're coming out in the storage room that I saw. Okay, that's pretty handy. We need to watch out. Yeah, there's a tiger right there by the looks of it. Let's, um... Let's get you tagged. Except it's not letting me tag. Damn it. 
Okay. Fine, but there is a tiger right outside there. None of these... Uh, none of these grated windows look like they're actually interactable. What do we got here? Some components. <laughs> okay, we can... We can loot some eddies from Roach Race while we're here. Might as well. Let's see. BD7A, BD, 1C, BD, 1C. Uh, beaten. Okay, let's do it the other way. 1C, BD, 1C. Or that one. BD, 7A. And we don't have a following BD, do we? Uh, let's just go for the top one. I'm not too bothered about Eddie's at the moment. Says the guy who's just splashed out 26k on a on a new uh, blue motor. Uh, 1C. Uh, can we do like an easy E955? Yeah, we can. Get that top line. Why not? Now. Oh, I don't like this. I'm going to drop a quick save. Oh, God. Oh, my God. I hate that. Right, let's uh, let's get you tagged. And where's the other guy just gone? He's literally just walked past us. Okay, never mind. Let's have a quick look at you. You don't have any brake hold. Come with me. I thought the door had shut behind me then. There we are. Right. Pilfer and move on through. There we go. Uh, I'll leave you here. Just worried uh, about dropping you down that hole in case um, in case somebody walks into the lower storeroom. I don't think they will, but just in case. Now, let's have a little looky-loo. Oh, hang on. We've got somebody over there. Right, that's you tagged. I wonder if that was the guy that walked past. Can we... Yeah, we can ping you. That's rather handy. Let's ping, retreat, and see who else we can spot. There's a guy right there. Oh, and someone over there. Oh, wonderful. We are actually surrounded. Oh, hello. There's their net runner. Right, in the office by the looks of it. Hmm, that's a bit of a bugger. All right, let's... Can I... Ah, oh, damn. Right, I can't seem to access that camera and this individual here is going to be a little bit of a problem as well right three more goons in the immediate vicinity can i perhaps hmm can i perhaps distract you with something maybe oh hang on here we go who's that going to distract is that going to distract this gonk to my right yes it is Right, let's do that temporarily. We can use that distraction to come over here, turn this camera off, and then slide this way. Oh, this person in the office here. Are they... Do they have brake hold? They don't. Right. Capitalize on this. Oh. Oh. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, we've got body storage right there, but... I'm... Wait, hold on. What? Did he... Did he hear me take the... Uh, take this individual down? Go back off of alert, please. Oh, they're all on alert. Why? Right, I'm going to have to see if I can find something. Can I run? Mm. I can run distract on that, but he'll see me as soon as he comes through the door, I think. Or at least see the body. Oh, God, stop making noise, V. Am I going to be able to do a distract? No, I can't. Crap. Right, he's gone back on to... He's rested again. Now, one thing I don't know, I'm going to drop a save here. I don't know if they actually um, take any notice of doors being opened. No, apparently they don't. That's kind of bizarre, but all right. We've got a radio up on the wall here. Excellent. Well, even better, actually, if I take him over to the other side of the room there. Meanwhile, Mars, Mars. get you hidden away. Oh, there's our net runner. 
Whoa. Right, you don't have break hold. Sucks to be you. Right, where can we hide you away? Oh, nowhere really. That's a bit of a shame. But okay. Uh... Hopefully nobody actually enters this room, otherwise I'm a little bit stuffed. Oh, damn it, there's nowhere in here to actually store a body. Wait, is that just a storage room? That might be better for us. Yeah, I think it will be, actually. Let's, um... Let's pick you up and just shift you into storage here, sir. I'd feel a lot happier about the situation if this were the case. Yeah, around this corner is looking good. Pop you there. There you go. Nice, quiet, secluded area away from the noise and the hustle and bustle for you to enjoy your eternal slumber. Don't say I never think of you. Right. Now, here's our net runner. So this net runner is trying to... Uh, is trying to locate the money that Vortex made off with by the sounds of it. What have we got in here? Ciao. Looks like our objective is just sat here on the desk. Right, so we could... Oh, here's Vortex's cred chip. Lovely. Okay. Deposit Vortex's cred chip in the drop point. So, what, that's it? We can leave now? But I don't want to. I want to find out... Um... Hold on one second. Why can I... Oh, I can't... Oh, that's crap. I want to take out this Jonin, but... It looks as though I don't have the ability to uh, hack her while she's while she's net running. I want to try and trace down her body if I can. Whoa! Oh, this is the bridge, isn't it? This is the footbridge where um where we came in. Yeah, it does not have break hold. Creepy, creepy. Creepy sneaky grab. Creepy sneaky grab. Tiptoe. Oh, I really thought there'd be a body stash point here somewhere. Never mind. Snap. Sit. Uh, right, access point. <laughs> Take a little few, uh, a few extra eddies on. Never say no. 1C557A. Right. 1C... 557A. Can we get another 1C? Start the next string. 1C BD 7A. Oh, beautiful. 1C 557A. 1C BD 7A9. Lovely. I can hear a thing. It sounds to me like. Like there's a drone around here somewhere. Right. Um, let's see now. Well, we've got our escape route pretty much, uh, pretty much sorted because we can just dive out that door. But I, oh god, oh. Uh, can we? Oh, it's just ashtrays. <laughs> um. Oh, I want to see if I can find her body. I want to see if I can find Vortex if I can. Seems to me like um. Like, finding out the location of her body is, uh... It's too much of a hint. Right, now, the question is, if I were to go back through the casino, would they take objection to my presence? They obviously would up here, because this is a hostile area, but if I went back downstairs to the main gaming floor, what would happen, I wonder to myself? I really want to <laughs> I really want to kill this Jonin. Like, really want to kill this Jonin. Oh, screw it. I'm going to go for it. Hey, oh. There we go. Nice and easy, does it? <laughs> Just definitely remove your entire cranium. Um, no, we didn't have anything of interest there anyway. Right, just grab my Tanto back. Hmm. Now, you're on the move. Let's see. Can we maybe run a distract on something? Oh, we're not close enough. Damn. Right. When this individual comes round a little bit more... Here we go. This might do it. Yes! I think you should go and investigate. I think that uh, that deserves your undivided attention. Uh. Uh. Sit! Sleep! 
Um, all right, let's maybe maybe move your body a little bit out of the way here. There we go, that'll do. I'm not too worried about, uh, not too bothered about keeping things out of sight now. I will, however, camera control here, just to see if anybody's actually on the balcony. No, it doesn't seem to be. Right, awesome. I think we've got free reign of the upper floor. I really don't feel like this today. Show yourself. Right, excellent. Now, the question is, as I said before, what is the story with downstairs? Because we've got free reign upstairs, and that's all fine and dandy, but what if I head back down? Are they going to aggro if I uh, make an appearance on the gaming floor? One way to find out, I guess. Okay. Let's <laughs> drop another quick save. Because this could go very south very quickly. I think I'm going to attempt to step out onto the gaming floor. If they take objection to my presence, then I will... Have I just drank some alcohol? Just notice the edge of the screen's got very blurry. I think I've uh, drunk something by accident. Uh, yeah, I'm going to step out into the floor under the shadow of... Uh, of this little stealthy schnoo. And re-materialize over here. Ah, oh, crap. That answers that question. Bye-bye <laughs> now. I'll just see myself out. Amazingly. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Nobody aggroed? They could clearly see me. I don't have time for this. Come on. Yeah, they're hunting for me, aren't they? Yeah, I think I've definitely outstayed my welcome. I really want to find where the kitchen is, though. Hold on. Stairs. No. Oh, do you know what? We've got what we came for. Finding a corpse isn't worth getting shot up, I don't think. Oh, we still got these guys. Excuse me, coming through. <clears throat> you ain't seen me. Yeah, lovely Hold stay. Up. It's paid to get to the side. That's lovely. I'm going out. Goodbye now. All right. <laughs> All right. I can't believe we managed to get out of there without a single bullet flying, but uh, not too shabby. Let's get to this drop point and, uh, and finish our business. Oh, just across the way by the looks of things. All right. There we go. Right, what's Wacker got to say about this one? What's she going to complain about now? I have received information that Vortex's shard is on its way. You did not disappoint me. <laughs> that deserves compensation. Thank you kindly. I am closing the contract and transferring your fee. Wonderful stuff. Well, I I did enjoy that. That's um that was a little bit tense at times, but I think we're all right. Okie dokie. Well, um, Japan Town, I, uh... Uh, what? <laughs> Hold on. What? Uh, why? Why is there a random... What looks like a tiger claw just... Laying in the middle of this area? What in the world? What? What the hell? <laughs> um... Colour me confused. Oh, whilst I... I need to drop into here to see what the hell's going on. Whilst I think of it, though, uh, I remember we picked up a samurai t-shirt and then completely forgot to equip the damn thing. Let's get that on. Lovely job. Now, uh, we have picked up a few new sets of trousers as well. Anything beating what we've currently got on? No, not really. Um. Oh, actually. Yeah, these combat trousers and these heavy-duty cargo pants do outstrip our current wear, but we'd lose that 25% stamina region that we've got on our current attire, so I'll stick with my current outfit. What about footwear? No, nothing even comes close. Right, what in the world? Oh, God, what have I stumbled? What have I just stumbled on? Is that a claw? Right, who are you? You don't look like a tiger claw, actually. What the hell's going on? Oh, hello. Right. The security turret, I think, is not going to uh, cause any any harm, I hope. What's this? Oh my god, it's like a little it's like a little netrunner's den. 
What's he saying? Warning, all activities are recorded. Okay. Item components. Jacket. <laughs> What's going on? Metal plating increases all resistances by 15%. Ah, that is... That's the second bullet mod. And I realised part way back we picked up a bullet mod. Uh, I can't remember exactly what it was. It was some sort of... Um, enhanced bullet and i couldn't work out how to actually equip the damn thing before we picked it up when we were in the scavenger den below you remember that dodgy was it was it richard or robert the dodgy ripper doc that uh, had a scav den right below his uh, his place but oh rachel hey see the <laughs> opening numbers Stevenson's uh, hit. i don't want to know you, you should not have put that out. That BD? Shouldn't have released it. Really. Get all that shit I said to you. Eddie's will hit your pocket soon. And should I mention there'll be a bonus? Uh, Enjoy! I don't want your bonus. I just, uh, it just feels icky. Bonus for leading a guy to his death. Uh, right, yeah, anyway, um, it, yeah, I worked out that those bullet mods are actually for the projectile launch system that you can put into your arms, which obviously I don't have. Um, 2010, that's all I got for it, okay. Nicely done, Eddie should have landed in your account, see? You're already making friends in high places. Fuck off, Rachel. Right, got a biohazard grenade. Can I please grab something that explains what the hell's going on here? Um, hardened net runner boots, skill shard for breach protocol. Okay, we'll take it. Another ram jolt. Here we go. An archive conversation between Mong and Sasha. Ice too thick. No, you think? This is Kuroshi we're talking about. Oh, is this a Kuroshi building? <gasps> they were trying to hack Kuroshi. Um, okay. Remember what I said? Uh, remember when I hacked the Mr. Stud and swapped out their slogan on their net page? I remember. Thrust till it busts. <laughs> Mr. Stud's ice was also pretty tight. A pencil dick couldn't even fit in there. Lol. I'm not... It's not like I'm saying no, except now we're talking industrial espionage. Their ice will fry you before you even catch a whiff of their data fortress. Unless you, some fixer gave you a special ice pick. Nope, but I got did get blueprints, mapped out their whole security. You got some kind of plan? I'll go in through the vents and jack into their subnet, bypass external security. Mmm, I don't know. Sure you won't get spotted. Glad you asked. That's where you come in. Need you to send me a demon to distract them. And what's in it for... What's it... For, what's in it for me? 15% if everything goes to plan. Fine. Just make sure your synapses don't catch fire. Wow. I, oh, I wish I could get a bead on... Oh, so he was jacked in. Right. Okay, so it looks like... This is some sort of Kuroshi data vault. Um... And, uh, yeah. They, they caught the big one. When, uh... When the security activated, looks like there was a few of them. Although these guys look like corpos more than net runners. Right, anyway, I'm getting out of here before something else activates. I don't like this at all. <laughs> That's so weird. What a random thing to just find in the middle of... I mean, what, what even is this? It's, it's literally just... Uh, it's literally just a, 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 a concealed room next to a big corporate building. So that must be a Kuroshi building, I guess. How strange. Right, I'm... <laughs> bit of a random encounter out in the streets, but, um... Yeah, that's a nice city, I guess. Okay, guys, that's about time we've all got... Uh, <laughs> that's about all we've got time for this time. I think I need a rest. Next time we, uh... Well, I suppose we need to sort of reconvene and uh, come up with a new plan. Let's have a quick look at the map. I'm pretty certain. Oh, no, we have... Oh, we've got the dealer's stash, of course, but it looks like, in terms of side gigs, that's it for Wakako. We've completed all of uh, Wako's side gigs. That was a lot quicker than I had expected. Nice! Right, so I'm going to head up to the dealer's stash next time, and uh, until then, if you'd like to leave a like, or you care to leave a comment, pop them in the usual location, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourselves now, guys. Bye-bye! <laughs>